Spinning records and serving up slices of Sacramento music history. That's the vibe at Solomon's Vinyl Diner in downtown Sacramento on K Street. So in this week's Farm to Fork Friday, k 3's Lisa Gonzalez is taking us to the special spot, dishing out the comfort food. Beats, bites, and booze. That's the theme at Solomon's Vinyl Diner. On this week's Farm to Fork Friday, we're on K Street in the heart of downtown Sacramento. And yes, Solomon's is named after Tower Records founder Russ Solomon. We've got the musical director, because if you've got Solomon's, you got to have a musical director, Brian Abs Washington with us. And also the sous chef, Jeremy Munoz. They've got an American diner menu here uh, Wednesday through Sunday and also music. We'll get to the music in a second, but first, let's start with the food. Uh, Jeremy, tell us about some of your, your favorites here. All right, so right here we got our breakfast sando with bacon. It's with, uh, on a homemade biscuit, uh, scrambled eggs, cheddar cheese, and bacon. Um, and then right next to it, we have our two egg classic, two eggs cooked anyway, uh, served with a biscuit, hash browns, and you could add proteins uh, or veggies like mushrooms, and that comes with a cinnamon honey butter. Ooh, I love cinnamon honey butter. Is that spam also? Correct, that is spam. <laughs> All right, and then this one, probably one of the most popular ones. Yeah, that's definitely our top seller right there. That's gonna be our chicken and French toast. Uh, we use our day-old milk buns and soak them in our uh, uh, egg batter. Uh, we toast them on each side. Okay, so if I want to make this at home, do you start out with basically making a French toast? Mm -hmm. Does yeah. it have to be day-old bread? That's what we prefer, yes. Uh, but we do sell it so much, sometimes we have to make it the day of. Okay, <laughs> and so then what do you, you soak it in egg, then you fry it? Yes, we fry it on both sides, get it nice golden brown, and then we put it in our oven for about five minutes at 350. Okay. Um, and then we fry our chicken. Okay. Uh, so however you like to fry your chicken, do that. And I feel like I could do this with, with with um, French toast at home. Yeah, you can do that with any French toast at home. Right. If you're using thicker sliced bread though, you do want to put it in the oven, make sure that egg cooks in the middle. Okay, great advice. And then how do you assemble this? What makes it really pop? Ooh, okay, so uh, our uh, maple syrup does have a little bit of cardamom in it, so it adds a little bit of heat to it. Mm -hmm. And then our uh, whipped cream is made with mascarpone. So right, let's go ahead and plate it right All now. All right. How would you do that? So we're gonna put our French toast, get our pieces of chicken right here. I'm going to wow my family this week, and I'm going to try and make this up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They'll love it, definitely, for sure. And you just syrup all over syrup. it. Yeah, it's got to get it nice and drenched. Uh -huh. That thick uh, toast definitely needs a lot of syrup. Okay. All right, and then we're going to get our mascarpone whip. How do you make that? Um, so it's about 20% mascarpone, heavy cream, and powdered sugar, and we whip that up until it's nice and fluffy. Oh. All right, that looks delicious. I love that. All right, so let's talk music because it is Solomon's, and of course there is the Tower Records, which is so critical to the history of Sacramento yes. here. You're the musical director. Talk about the music events that you have going on. Thursday nights we do Vibe, which is a live music presentation. Fridays we have our curator series where we bring in tastemakers from around the city to play music for us that inspires them. And then on Saturdays and Sundays you have DJs playing vinyl records at our daytime parties. That's awesome. So you've got brunch and you can have DJ and music, and, yeah. and that's why it's called Beats, Bites, and Boost. That's correct. <laughs> all yeah. right. From Solomon's on this Farm to Fork Friday, it all looks delicious, and it sounds good, too.